President Donald Trump's Secretary of Health and Human Services issues a dire warning about the spread of coronavirus. Johns Hopkins University says the pandemic has claimed more than a half a million lives worldwide, and more than a quarter of that total comes from the United States. This is a very, very serious situation, and the window is closing for us to take action and get this under control. Health Secretary Alex Azar says along with a jump in coronavirus cases, hospitalizations in southern states are also on the rise. But he denies that reopening businesses too quickly was tied to the rise in cases. Even so, the Trump campaign called off Vice President Mike Pence's campaign rallies this week in Florida and Arizona. We encourage uh, everyone to wear a mask uh, in the affected areas and where you can't maintain social distancing. The vice president still traveled to Texas yesterday where he met with the state's governor and attended a freedom rally at a Baptist church. Only about half of the people attending the church rally wore masks, even though Texas is one of at least 31 states seeing a rise in coronavirus cases. In California, some businesses are shutting down again, just days after opening their doors. At some point, we have to say this is where we are as a business and as a state, and we're going to adjust. We want to get the economy back, but you've got to do it in a measured way. And now we're seeing the consequences of community spread. Yet Secretary Azar maintains the U.S. is in a better position than ever before to track and treat the virus. We now have three therapeutics. We have hospital capacity. We have reserves of personal protective equipment. Uh, we're, we're speeding our way towards, uh, towards having vaccines.